Hello everyone, today we will see how to replace the hard disk of an Lenovo G50 or 80 laptop or notebook. We can upgrade it with a new HDD or else new SSD that is solid state drive. Turn your laptop upside down. Just remove these two screws here for opening the back cover or compartment door you can say. Just remove these three screws. Push the door back, pull it up, here you can see this is your hard disk, unscrew only these 4 screws, before that I would advise you to remove the battery first, removing the battery is important because if any of the screws which you have removed from hard disk or anywhere else falls on the motherboard, it may cause damage to the motherboard and the motherboard may not, you will have to replace the motherboard because when battery is connected, the 11.5 volts is flowing most of the places and 5 volt and 3.3 are always generated. This is your hard disk. Take it out. This, we unscrew these 4 screws here. Hard disk has come with separate holders on both the sides. Left, this is left, and this is right. Hope you understood. Here it is written. It should come on the left of the hard disk. This is on the right. See here, this screw is very tight. Just give a twist this way. After taking a new hard disk, put it upside down, and this holder, which has a step, it should come on the left side of the hard disk, that is right side of ours, my right side. Here it is written right, so it should be on our right side. This one should come on the left. This two hole holes not should be on the front. It is towards the connector. And insert it back here. Push it from the back side. See that it is fitting correctly inside towards the connector. Fasten the four screws. Back cover or the door. It should fit in this way. Just go on fixing it, pressing it in this way. Don't press it like this. Keep it in this way. Push it gently. And it should lock. Yes, in this way. It should lock like this. With your battery, As you can see there is a groove for fitting the battery and notches here. So insert the battery in this way, turn it and lock it. We are done. If you install after installing your new hard disk, just it's ready to for installing the OS. Thank you for watching, everyone. Have a good time.